Salut tout le monde, hello everyone. Welcome to episode 9 of Spore. Now last time we had just finished off the tribal stage and begun the civilization stage. We designed ourselves a little town hall thingy like this and a tank-ish thingy. And we had begun our takeover of the planet. So our first mission is pretty much just a tutorial thing that's to claim a spice geyser. So we're gonna make our little tank go over there. Basically, in this stage, you just gotta take over the world. It's not too complicated. You use your tanks and other vehicles to claim spice geysers and interact with other uh, towns that start up and all that stuff. So, so here's our city hall. If we go into the city planner, like it's telling us to do, we can do a bunch of stuff. So we can add houses, entertainment stuff, factories, and turrets, which are very useful. Uh, we can change how our vehicles look, we can design new ones, we can have sea vehicles, and air vehicles, and spaceships eventually. Um, we can add decorations, which I'm probably not going to bother with. We can change our town tune, and we can change our outfit. It's all very fancy, so I'm going to just go in the outfitter because our dudes need an updated wardrobe. So, I'm gonna get rid of most of this stuff, cause, yeah. Except the mustache, I need the mustache, obviously, cause, jeez. So, we... what kind of hats do we want? Goodness, I like this one. I think it would look very silly. Oh, yeah. That looks extremely silly. It's gotta cover the eyes a little bit. At least the eye stalks. I think that'll do. So now we got a silly hat. We can have fancy masks. I'm not gonna bother. Unless you guys want one, feel free to let me know what you guys want. Let's see. Would this fit well? Oh yeah. Wonderful. Fancy bow tie. Let's see. Make this really big. And attempt to stick it to his body. Check that out, how snazzy is that? Alright, some epaulets. Mm, they don't even really have shoulders, so I think I'm gonna pass on that. And anything else we should add? Ooh, hair. Can I manage to stick it onto the head? Oh dear, that's frightening. Oh, oh my, I'm trying to move this. It's not really working out. Oh my. Almost. Uh, yeah. Okay. Wonderful. I'm gonna make this pretty small. How small can it go? Yeah, they've got hair sort of now. Only on the sides though. Uh, and a little bow? No. A medallion? No. If you guys want to see me add anything on, feel free to let me know. This is what our citizens are going to look like now. So, it's pretty silly. Alright, so I'm going to just plop in some buildings. Uh, I don't think I'm going to bother designing any right now. Although, if you guys have any requests, again, feel free. I'm just going to pick random ones that have been made. Oh my goodness, this one is so colorful! I'm picking this one because it's super colorful. So much color. Entertainment. What kind of entertainment buildings do we need here? Um. This one looks weird, so why not? And. What's this? A factory. Right, okay. So basically, you gotta like plan out how your little cities look. Because if you put a factory right next to a house, people aren't that happy, but if you put entertainment there, it makes them happier, but it, like, gives your output less, so you kinda gotta plan things out. You've got, like, these little spots where you can put everything, so I'm just gonna plop some structures down. It makes unhappiness, but it gives you plenty of cash, so I can't really afford anything else right now, so gonna grab this thing. I think I can pause. No, I can't pause. I gotta look for more spice geysers. Spice, spice, spice. Oh snap, another tribe has begun 
on the path to trying to take over the world. We must hurry and take over all the spice geysers before they get to them. So another tribe of the species has built something on the continent. Hurrah. So, we have abilities, which is super duper. So, tank over here. Oh my goodness. I think they might get there before we do. Yeah, basically when you have a spice geyser or something, it uh, changes the color of the borders here, as you can see. Which basically tells you how much of the map belongs to your people. So, it's always good to have as much as you can. I don't know where the heck this guy's going. Whatever. So, um, I think I can interact with them. First, I really want to give our dudes some entertainment here. Here and this here. No, oh, good gracious. I'm doing things all backwards. No, wait, if I put the house here. Ah, uh, that works okay. They're not super unhappy, so it's good. Where's our little tank? Alright. We'll grab this one before well, anyone else does. Alright, so I think we can interact with them if we click on their city. Hello, give gift, contact, capture city. I'll just contact them for now. Oh, look at our little people. They look silly. Speak your mind. Um, yeah, I guess I'm gonna be pleasant to them so that we can form some kind of alliance. Just in case, and then later on we're gonna destroy them completely. And that'll be fun. So. Hello, people. Uh, Apparently, we perplex them. Uh, try and get on their good side for now. Oh, there's another civilization. Hello. Oh, oh, oh. oh yes, more friendly people. Why not? Where's my little tank thing? Okay, there it is. I don't think there's anything really left to claim. Ah, damn. Yeah, they're already claiming it. So. I'm gonna just send my tanks over here. Looks like we're getting plenty of cash, so I really want to design our city to work a little better. Because we need lots of money if we're going to destroy everyone. Houses. I'm just going to leave that be for now and buy a little vehicle thing. So basically, we can select vehicles just like we used to. We can click them on here, tell them to do things. But uh, for now, we don't really have much for them to do. Good gracious, they're so happy. All right, so now we got a pretty decent amount of vehicles. I wonder if we could try and take these red guys. Vehicles over there. That'd be nice, thanks. Curb the blasters. I'm really not Curb going to be blast. kind to these people. So we're going to destroy them. Just keep Extra building dirt. vehicles. Can laugh the shoot. Squadlo. Usually I tend to take a more diplomatic approach, but uh, yeah, this time not so much, I guess. Which is okay. They seem to be getting pretty much wrecked. I don't know what these green guys are doing. Oh, okay. You can see what type of vehicle they are by the little icon that shows up when you hover over. So these are commerce vehicles. Basically, if we weren't uh, super violent and combat oriented, we could be either commerce, or we could be, like, religious or something. 
It's basically just different ways to take over other cities. So it all leads to the same. It's not really a problem. So happy and I'm gonna have to build some turrets soon before people get some nasty ideas. But we are taking over the city, which is wonderful. So, uh, they want me to do stuff with a sea vehicle, so I'm going to design one. Well, I'm not gonna design one, but let's see. It's nothing that I made, huh? No. Okay. This one looks really colorful. It has the name Rainbow in it, so why not? Oh, wait a minute. I should really uh, design one because vehicles are important. So. I'm going to make some kind of a boat. Um, it's going to be very long and tall. Okay. It's fine. Alright. Cockpit. Um, let's see. going to have some kind of a thing here. Why not? need some ways to get around. No. Aqua sled. That looks, or that sounds pretty, uh, pretty speedy. Trying not to get it right in the water. But, uh. and a sail. Okay, well first we need to figure out our military stuff. So we need big guns. Right on the front. Wonderful. Oh dear. There we go. And, uh... Gracious. Okay, that one is a little weird. That'll do, I guess. Just make it smaller. There we go. That looks nice. Sort of. So, health and speed. <laughs> These ores just look silly. I'm putting them on the top because they don't even make sense. We will terrify them with our ores. And we should probably have some kind of health stuff. What can give us health? None of these. And none of these. Um, I'll just. Yeah, I think that'll just do, anyways. So, boat name, water tank. Yes. Who needs warships or battleships or whatever? When you can have water tanks, the best aquatic vehicle. There we go. I think that'll do. That'll do just fine. So, let's see. Now we have water vehicles that we can buy once we got cash. For now, we do not have enough cash. So, we're gonna take over the cities. Huzzah. Little cinematic plays. Now they're all sort of purple, reddish, whatever that color is. Hurrah! Now we own them. We have captured this economic city by military means! Yay! We're gonna go full military because I said so. So now we can build air vehicles, which is exciting. Um, for now, though, I'm going to just destroy these guys. And that'd be wonderful. Alright. Our economies must go. We have to establish a trade route. Um, okay. I guess my fleet will just go take over the orange guys instead. Because they look unfriendly. So. Apparently they're very happy though, which is nice, I guess. So, I'm gonna build some structures, and then we can get this boat thing going. Um, let's see, we need a factory right here, and then another house here. And we cannot afford any more than that, unfortunately. Looks like everyone pretty much claimed the water uh, 
the spice geysers. There's only one left on the map. So whatever. That's okay. Okay, these guys really need some stuff. So we're gonna give them a little building here. No, this here. Factory. What? I can't even put a factory down. Factory first. Be unhappy. I don't even care. How are my guys doing going towards here? Alright, well they're getting there. Slowly but surely. We need more money. Okay. Should be able to upgrade their little structures. Right, so we need a house here, another one here, and an entertainment thing here. And now they're super duper happy and they're not gonna complain. So that is superb. Super de duper. What are you Is he trying to take over my city? Oh, the little jerk. Looks like there's some combat going on over here. Oh my goodness. Uh, well that thing is pretty much dead. So too bad for them, I guess. Should have focused a little more <coughs> on, the, on the military stuff. I think I can build like one more thing here. Mm. I guess that'll do. They're really happy, so. I'm not gonna bother with turrets when we still have to upgrade our little town here. Entertainment thing. Now they're super happy and they're giving us lots of cash. That is fantastic. And my guys over here are destroying this city, it looks like, which is just perfect. Oh, they actually have turrets. That's uh, surprising. I guess I should build some on my town too. Little turrets. we go back over here. Alright, so we've been running for about 17 and a half minutes. We have claimed a city and are in the process of claiming this one, so that's not bad. Still have two more continents to go, unfortunately. I'm gonna build a sea vehicle, because they really want us to for some reason. <coughs> Communications panel. Hmm. I guess the orange guys really hate us, and they have multiple cities now, so that's nice. Oh my gosh, do they really have something to say? Yeah, okay. They can say whatever they want. All I know is they're not threatening me. They're not intimidating me, rather. We are destroying their little city. So soon they will only have one. Aha. We have stolen their city. Another little cutscene. They have creepy tentacle decorations. That's a little frightening. They are going to stay military because they were military to begin with, I believe. So it will be remain military city. to take over their spice geyser. What? They would like to establish a traitor? I'm not sure. My guys are gonna take over that spice geyser. Right the heck now! Alright, so we gotta design a vehicle. Well, we can't design an air vehicle yet. Unfortunate. That's okay though. Oh my, what is happening here? My city is under attack. Oh, okay. That's cool. I guess I'll just have to grab all my guys and have to destroy this dude. Bring the base. Here you go, have a turret. Enjoy being shot. And another turret. Wonderful. 
Yeah, that thing is just going to be dead. Wonderful. So now I'm going to steal this geyser back. I guess I should uh, give them a few more turrets. Do they still have all their structures? Yeah, looks like they're alright. Okay. Turrets. So, turrets built. So now they got three turrets. Oh. So now they have three turrets. The blue people are getting pretty upset. That's fine. Whatever. Um, we should really work on this city here. So. We need a few turrets. That one is messed up. Okay. Let's figure I should have turrets first. There we are. Destroy these jerks. Alright guys. Go over here and destroy them in the base. There. That should be enough military vehicles to completely crush them. And then we will have captured an entire continent, which is just one. So for the time being, I'm going to add some factories here. And a couple of house things. Happy, but soon they will not be. So that's okay. Alright. So we are taking over their city, am I right? Yes, we are destroying them, which is wonderful, because they're extremely unhappy anyways. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. Whatever. I'll just uh, make sure I'm covered in turrets. Our capital city is a fortress. So, too bad for them. So, I'm just gonna finish off this continent and then we can end the episode. And it should not take long because they are really just about to die. There we go. Fantastic. Another military city has been captured by us. Is that a dead guy standing? Lying on the ground there? That's a little frightening. Oh me oh my. Excellent. We have captured this military city by military means. And now, our guys have discovered that we can have planes. Planes are the most badass of things, by the way. Except for spaceships, obviously. Oh yeah, now we can have planes. Basically, that's what they're saying, so that's excellent. Because planes are the best. Um, excuse me? Somebody wants some turrets in the face. Yeah, that's what I thought. Alright, well, I'm going to end the episode here. So, I hope you guys enjoyed episode 9 of Spore. Uh, next time, I'm hoping to basically take over another continent. That would be cool. And, uh, yeah. Well, that's about it, really. So, thanks, as always, for watching. And I hope you guys have an awesome day.